Hello everyone, and welcome back to our Stalker Gamma Ecologist run, where we are playing Dr. Krominov, the ecologist who does not take assassination missions and does not wear the armor and weapons of fallen enemies. Right, so last episode, we actually did quite a lot. We finished hunting down the artifacts in Jupiter, after that, we came through Jupiter Underground to Outskirts, where we fought a pack of Chimeras. We fought a Black Chimera. We fought some controllers. Well, the Mercs fought most of the controllers, but yeah, we managed to take out a couple of Unisig patrols. We took out a couple of Monolith patrols, all in a scientist's day of work. And we also got the two artifacts for the ecologists, of course, one at the school and one at the Vine Anomaly. And we finished our episode right here at the Laundromat. And next up, we will have to go to, to Pripyat. Now, I'm not sure how we're going to do this, because we don't want to draw Eidolon in and also, we don't really want to fight the whole monolith base now, do we? Hmm. Well, we're just gonna head over to the outskirts and see how it goes. And if I feel like we're not doing okay in there, we're just gonna return and uh, we'll try going in a different way. Uh, I also made this little stash here. I bought it straight from the standard merchant guy. So these are all the things we left behind. Um, and we'll, we'll just come back for them later, mm, I think. Absolutely. Double check over there, make sure there isn't anything. And we're gonna have to pass by that Ooh! Давай, давай. I am running HP ammo, so... It's lucky these guys are pretty lightly armored. For standard monolith, just gonna use FMJ. Come on, poke your head out, I know you want to. Alright, so it's uh, actually Sin. <sighs> Not sure how I am with the meds right now. I mean, we could be worse. what might as well take one of these as I was gonna say might as well take one of these as well but it sounds bad oh okay who threw that tell you what <laughs> okay, and we're... Guess we could just eat another one of these. Yeah, this, this is just uh, standard outskirts. At this point, I'm not even amazed anymore.
Okay. The exit is right at the end of this building, so... Let's move straight there. Where was it? Running FMJ, switch to the other aiming mode, and... We are... in Pripyat. I don't know why I'm talking so uh, low. It's not like the monolith can actually hear me. Right, so... My biggest fear right now is running face-to-face -face with... A lot of mutants. It's also very foggy and I don't like it. Okay. So, first things first, we're gonna go... Gonna keep to the outskirts of the map. We're gonna try not to draw any monolith in. Now this has its own risk because we're more susceptible to meeting mutants. Like that. Okay, I really... Oh! I saw him. The problem is... Where the hell is it? Oh, he's getting close. Whew. Hip, would you? Let me pass, please. All right. So, that was kind of what I was uh, most afraid of with sticking to the outskirts. It's basically just pulling in mutants. Luckily, it wasn't that bad this time. Could have been a pseudo giant, which would have been way worse. I'm gonna climb up here. Oh, the rats! Hopefully no one notices me. Now, if Hip decides to take all of Monolith by herself, um, I think, I, I, I guess we're gonna have to help her, I don't know. Now, I do remember this anomaly area. It's not exactly where it points. I think it was on the other side of the building through, through an underground parking. But I'm not 100% sure. Okay, please, please don't pull any more here. Well, Hip seems to think that there will be more monolith, but she still appears engaged, but Oh! oh! Okay, that's why she was still engaged. And she actually stole that guy's rifle? I mean, what? whatever. 
Right, so it's definitely not here. If I remember correctly, we have to go through this underground garage. Yeah, we, we just heard some more monolith down there. Not sure what they're fighting. But I hope they killed each other. Do a quick look around here just because I don't want don't want them to get in my back. And there's the artifact right there. So if we just move up here, nice and easy, we should be able to get well, we, we got it, even though it uh, buzzed. Hip. Come on. Move over. Okay. So, that was it. That was it for this one. Oh, that's a kind of... This one got us, but... Oh, there's a couple of lurkers coming in. Heal up. I think they actually died in the electric anomalies. Okay, we should be safe now. Uh... That was so sudden, I didn't even get to tell you guys to pause the video, like, and subscribe. Uh, so, you'll just have to do it on the next Chimera. Right, but we are not done yet. This was actually the easy anomaly here. The next one is... Uh, it's it's a, on a whole different level. So let's try not to pull the base once again. Wanna go all the way back to the original main building where we were. And we're gonna go through the building. I know there's a radiation pocket here, so I'm just gonna run through it really fast. From here, we're just gonna walk normally because I don't wanna attract any unwanted attention. Very annoying because it's foggy and I can't tell where anything is. I, uh, Pripyat is not my favorite place and usually I only come here once a run. And it's just to do the missions with uh, Strelok. And then I never come back here again. So, my knowledge of Pripyat is pretty limited. Now, I do know that right here at the Stadium Passage, there is a monolith um, barricade. I'm gonna switch to AP, but I do wonder if we can get around that. Hmm, not sure we can. And vault up there. Nice and easy. Uh, Hip, why don't you sneak? Never mind. Okay, this is bad. This is very bad. We make too much noise here, they're gonna pull the whole base. Can we vault over this? Yes, we can, apparently. Ah. 
magazine. Okay, I'm gonna run all the way up here and hopefully Pip will follow and the whole base won't get pulled. Okay, Hip is no longer engaged, which is a good thing, but we're not done yet. This place is, uh, I mean, there's a dead pseudo giant jumper. I, I think that's, that's all you need to know, right? Okay, we are back. Now, you might have noticed that the weather changed. That is because when I switched to my detector, we got the busy hands bug for some reason. So I had to reload the game right here where I quick saved. Okay, so here we are. The artifacts right there. Looks so close, doesn't it? Okay, let's get ready properly I'm just gonna fix up everything hip come over here I need the controller scalp from you so controller scalp and I think it was the boar belt that gave us a little bit of impact resistance yeah and unfortunately, I think that's as much as we can get. We also have the morphine, but uh, I think that's only ballistic resistance. So, it's right there. I mean, it looks like it would be easy, right? It's not. Okay. So. That's the only way I know of getting this artifact, which is basically getting bopped. Because uh, it just refreshes, the anomaly refreshes so fast, you can't really trigger it with a bolt and then uh, get away with it. So, yeah. Okay, but... Now we are done with these. Which means we can start going back to Jupiter. And I think we can actually jump this gate here. I really don't want to pull any more monolith. Oh, we don't even need to jump the gate. Oh, but... Come on. Is there an invisible wall here? Yes, there is. Okay. In that case, let's just uh, move nice and slow. We do know there's a controller at the other exit. And actually even set a waypoint here. And hopefully Hip, which I don't know where she's going, but hopefully she won't be stupid and pull the whole base. And if she does, I'm just gonna run for it, I think. Alright, she, she's coming over. Should be good, hopefully. Especially since we're walking nice and slow. Usually there's a few guys over there in that building. cigarettes don't really care about the beef shanka but we'll take that as well and uh, if we move nice and slow hopefully they won't notice we're here if you ever start there he is
Okay. And now we are free to go back to Jupiter. Ooh. Okay, we're back safe and sound in Jupiter. Whew, that was crazy. All right, I do wanna go here to the left because I heard a few gunshots there. All right, there's actually a Merc team there. Yeah, they, they won't want to join because there's simply too many of them, but... Ah, hip. Okay, I'll, I'll go help hip. Good enough. Okay, so... Let's see who is where. So there's Mercs here, not a problem. And no military or anyone else in the Jupiter entrance, which means we might have to clear it. And then I'll just move up the road all the way back to Yanov Station. Doesn't look like anyone's there, so I'm I'm not gonna push my luck. Can switch to HP here. Okay, we are back at Yonat Station. I took a little bit of time to sell and put stuff back in our stash. Oh, that's... That wasn't good. <laughs> right. Note to self, watch where you're going. Alright, so... I think I still have a bullet hole somewhere in my suit from those damn fanatics. But I managed to check out the anomalies you mentioned. I even found some samples for you. Phenomenal! Please take this! You earned it! 5,000 rubles. Thank you! Thank you so much! That should be it for now. If you want to earn more money collecting artifacts, you might want to search for some of my colleagues in the zone. I'll let you know I let them know you're coming. Do you have anything else I can help you with? This is all for now. If you want to help us further, then I will send you to a colleague of mine who will appreciate your help. I'll send you his location and let him know you're coming. Farewell, stalker. We need to find Professor Vorobushkin. And Professor Vorobushkin... Oh, it's this one! I forgot he existed! I thought it's gonna send us straight to the uh, nuclear power plant, but you know what? Let's move to Zaton, finally. Okay, so first things first, I'm gonna visit the mercs. See if any of them want to help me out. I don't see any stars on the map, so... I'm guessing that's gonna be a no. But we do have a mission to find a stash here. 
Also, there is one Merc outside that could want to join. No. Basically, the stars show you which are the commanders for the squads. And only a squad commander can um, decide to join. Okay, trading weapons. Okay, if it's expensive, it goes boom. Um, there we go. Oh, he does have a nice assortment of weapons. I mean, I don't know about nice, but it's definitely an assortment of weapons. Ooh, a vector. But that's pretty much it, so not really such a big deal. Okay. Let's go grab that thatch. And then we can head over to our ecologist friend. They don't have pathing all the way down here. Okay. Ah, oh, we're not done yet. Here comes the um, annoying part, which is dealing with whoever is at the factory right now. Sometimes it's clear and there's no one. Sometimes you'll get the fight of your life here. Sin and Unisig is what you should expect. And we have Monolith. It's never just one. Rads are crazy here. Let's get this under control. Mm. Okay, that should be a bit better. have to smoke just to mitigate the incoming radiation coming uh, incoming radiation okay calm down I'm, I'm one of you guys what you gonna do with that arm cell anyway reload on me right what's up professor need a hand in anything our business is drawing to a close soon we will prove that we deserve to take our place you know that there is a giga anomaly in the center of the zone and all the PSI lines intersect there. Oh, the Psi lines. <laughs> An artifact that will be born in this unique place will have unique properties. The zone will finally speak to us. With us? I might. Well, this area... Or it might? I have no idea what he's trying to say. Well, this area is poorly explored, so I don't fully know what to expect. However, my calculations predict that I should be able to find the artifacts I need here. Yesterday, in order to pinpoint the anomalous fields that need to be investigated, I repaired some of the equipment at the Krug Antenna Complex. However, the scan took quite long and it got more dangerous the longer I stayed up there, so I had to return here in a hurry. You need to enter the station and pick up the memory module I left there. All the necessary data should be on it. By the way, there are several anomalies nearby, perhaps they contain the samples I need, but it will be impossible to say before retrieving the scan data. Okay, let's get out of this irradiated hellhole. <laughs> oh, 
Okay, gonna do a quick check near that port there. Dock, whatever you want to call it. Because sometimes there is monolith or mercs there. Don't mind the mercs, but don't want monolith behind us, right? And we will go all the way to... I completely forgot what the shipwreck is called. Um... But, uh, yeah, where Beard is. And we'll also get our reward for getting there as part of the Li Living Legend mission. And I can hear some gunfire over in that direction. That shipwreck there usually has some friendly stalkers, but... Oh, it's monolith. Oh, there, there was a legendary monolith in there. Double tap for safety. And Spartacus actually managed to live. That doesn't happen often. <laughs> okay, gonna stick to AP. And Spartacus is still fighting in there, so there's definitely going to be more monolith. Or maybe he's going to die before we even get there. Huh. Never mind. They won. Doesn't mean I won't loot everyone. <laughs> oh, God, more radiation. This is crazy. We we need a better suit to be here. Ooh, a butcher. I would have loved that. <laughs> why I'm even looting these guys there. They might as well be naked. Okay, and final monolith. Ooh, a KS-12. I would have loved that as well. Okay, let's just jump down. Okay. And we can go back. Oh, there's a controller there. Okay, and now the loner base is fighting someone. Not sure what it is, so I'm gonna switch to FMJ. I think we're alright. Don't know why they were so bothered. Oh, I think it's a dog, maybe? No. No idea. Wait a second. I definitely heard shots. Oh, okay, sinners.
That seems to be clear now, so... More loot for me, I guess. Okay, gonna, as always, do a quick tour to see if anyone wants to join up with us. Some of these are named and uh, will never join. For example, Rogue. Okay, let's have a little talk with Beard. It must be Beard. What can I do here and all that? Uh, we talk to him about Skrelok. He gives us a new mission. Bit of vodka, bit of money. It's not much, but it is something. And I think that's about it. Beard. We're gonna have to talk to Rogue now. And uh, he's gonna tell us to go patch the um, Gauss rifle prototype for him. Which we will. It's pretty much in the way anyway. No, привет. This will be our mechanic here. So I'm gonna go ahead and sell a lot of stuff. Right, anything else? For now this should be enough. We still have repair parts, we are good. Okay, and the general trader is right here. That was a monolith PDA. And he actually wants NATO weapons. That's so weird. Since he only sells partial packed um, bullets. <laughs> what was I going to do? Yes, I want to drop some of the stuff in the stash. We have a jellyfish. Drop that. Didn't I sell one of these or did I pick another one from the sinner? Okay, all of these. This, this and this. And of course, all of these. We kind of have a little stash in each place in the north now. Right, we can have another Chimera meal. Okay. So, there's a duty there. That's interesting. Hmm. I, I actually want to take a look at that guy. We, we are... We don't have good relations with duty, do we? Oh, it's minimal. I'm, I'm not gonna, actually. Right. But I think we will end this episode here. So, our next mission will be to go... Well, we have the Living Legend experimental weapon, but we also have... the memory module and the free anomalous samples he said it's in the antenna complex and that is right here it's usually full of unisig or sin or monolith but we should be able to deal with it i mean we've dealt with worst in the outskirts and after that we're gonna have to take uh, to find free anomalies here free artifacts one of them will be at the bridge one of them will be here somewhere. And there was another one, but I don't remember where. I think it might be at the Burnt Village. Or in here somewhere. Or there might be two sets of uh, artifacts. I don't remember exactly. And after that, I think the next one will be in the nuclear power plant courtyard, then generator. So we are getting close to the end of our artifact hunt. And of course, the end of the series with that, because we are not doing the main story. We are just doing the artifact hunts for science. But I might actually go through the nuclear power plant 
just to get to the wish granter, which is probably one of the most important artifacts. Plus, we need to take the shard of the monolith. That's also an artifact, I think. But we will also have to do the secondary missions for Agroprom Underground and uh, the Miracle Machine, otherwise known as Lab X16. And I might even do Lab X19, though I don't really think I will. I'll think about it. But yeah, we had a pretty good episode. We finished the um, artifacts in Pripyat, which was uh, crazy. We managed to evade the main monolith base. We still had a few issues, but we managed to get through it pretty nicely. And we also managed to make our way all the way back uh, back into Jupiter and then to Zaton. We met with Beard, we met with Rogue, and we got our next mission. And of course, we will do it next episode. Until then, I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you all next time.